he was famous for being right until the day his own data betrayed him. In a quiet laboratory humming with fluorescent light, a celebrated scientist stared at a chalkboard covered in equations he had written decades earlier. These ideas had built his reputation, earned him invitations, applause, and reverence. They were taught in universities, printed in textbooks, repeated as truth. And now, line by line, the evidence he had just gathered was tearing them apart. Years earlier, his hypothesis had seemed elegant, almost beautiful. It explained chaos with simplicity. It made predictions that worked, at first. Colleagues praised it, funding flowed. His name became inseparable from the theory itself. To question it felt like heresy. But science is patient, and reality keeps records. Late nights turned into longer ones. Instruments grew more precise. Anomalies appeared, small at first, easy to dismiss. A rounding error, a faulty sensor, a strange outlier. He ignored them. Everyone does, at least once. But the anomalies multiplied. They whispered a quiet, persistent question. What if you're wrong? The room changed as doubt crept in. The excitement that once filled the lab was replaced by tension. Each new experiment pressed closer to the truth, and the truth was unforgiving. Then came the result he couldn't escape. The data was clean, repeated, verified by his own hands. His theory, his life's work, did not survive contact with reality. For days, he said nothing. He could have stayed silent, let someone else discover the flaw years later, let history soften the blow. But every value in those tables stared back at him, demanding honesty. At a conference packed with expectant faces, he stepped onto the stage. The audience leaned forward, ready for another confirmation of brilliance. Instead, he dismantled himself. Slide by slide, he showed how the evidence contradicted his claims, how newer measurements revealed assumptions that no longer held, how his theory failed, not because science was broken, but because it worked exactly as it should. The room fell silent. Some felt shock, others disbelief. A few felt admiration they didn't yet understand. Because in that moment, he did something rarer than being right. He chose truth over legacy. His reputation didn't vanish. It transformed. He became a symbol, not of certainty, but of integrity. Proof that science is not about defending ideas, but about surrendering them when the universe disagrees. And that is the quiet power of real discovery. Not proving yourself right, but having the courage to prove yourself wrong. If this story moved you, share it with someone who loves learning. Like the video, subscribe for more stories like this, and leave a comment. What belief do you think the future will overturn next?